good morning good afternoon good evening viewers depending on time and location you are watching us from you welcome to enlightened tv home of trending news what we publish is on politics entertainment celebrity and metro news today's headline reads president trump orders navy to shoot down destroy iranian boats if they harass american ships in the gulf in escalation of tension with Tehran. If this is your first time of watching any video in our channel, we urge you to click on the red subscribe button below this video and the bell icon beside it to stay updated. Here are the news in detail. President Donald Trump said on Wednesday he had instructed the US Navy to fire on any Iranian ship that harassed it at sea. A week after 11 vessels from Iranian Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps Navy IRGCN came dangerously close to U.S. ships in the Gulf. I have instructed the United States Navy to shoot down and destroy any and all Iranian gunboats if they harass our ships at sea, Trump wrote in a tweet hours after Iranian Revolutionary Guard Corps said he had launched the country's first military satellite into orbit. The tweet came amidst a recalation of tension with Iran's Revolutionary Guard saying hours earlier that they had launched the country's first military satellite, which the U.S. regards as a cover for missile development. The first satellite of the Islamic Republic of Iran had been successfully launched into orbit by the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps, said the Guard Tiffany's website. It said the satellite doubled the nor which meant means light had been launched from the Quast 2 stage launcher from the Makazi Desert, a vast expanse in Iranian's central plateau. The satellite orbited the Earth at 264 miles said the website this action will be a great success and a new development in the field of space for islamic iran the statement added the surprise operation comes more than two months after iranians launched but failed to put into orbit another satellite that he said had no military dimension washington says that this satellite launched defies a UN Security Council resolution on ballistic missiles. US officials fear that the launches could help Iran develop intercontinental ballistic missiles capable of carrying nuclear weapons. Iran maintains it has no intention of acquiring nuclear weapons, claiming its aerospace activities are peaceful and comply with the UN's order. It is not believed that the Iran has the technology to miniaturize a nuclear weapon on a ballistic missile. And Trump, Trump's intervention in a week after nearly a dozen Iranian naval vessels repeatedly harassed and made dangerous approaches to the American ship conducting operation in the Persian Gulf near Kuwait in a tense action that lasts more than an hour. A group of 11 ships with Iranian Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps especially crossed the balls and stern of the U.S. Navy Banyan Base, 5th Fleet at close range and high speed, with one passing within just 10 meters of a Coast Guard quarter. The dangerous and provocative actions increased the risk of miscalculation and collision a statement from U.S. Central Command said, adding that U.S. commanders on the scene terrain the inherent right to self-defense. The American vessel included the USS Paul Hamilton, a Navy destroyer, the USS Levis B. Puller, a ship that serves as an afloat landing base, and the U.S. C. G. C. Moore Coast Guard vessels are part of the U.S. forces in the Gulf. The ships were operating with U.S. Army at 
Apache attack helicopter in international waters. The statement said. Thank you very much for watching this video to the end. God bless us. I urge at this point to drop your comment. What is your view? Don't forget I said in uh, Trump's uh, Twitter handle, he tweeted, I have instructed the U.S. state, the United States Navy, to shoot down and destroy any and all Iranian gunboats if they harass a ship at the sea. Drop your comment. Let's get to hear from you. Don't fail to hit on the red subscribe button below this video and the bell icon beside it to stay updated. Thank you very much once again for watching this video. And God bless us.